Hello, I'm Gabriel with West Palm Dogs, and today I'm here with Parker, and we're working on his loose leash walking. So what we're working on is keeping him in position. So I'm going to start walking. So Parker, let's go. When you start the walk, you say the dog's name and say, let's go. And what I want to do is keep Parker in position. So I'm going to do what we call circles of control. And circles of control teaches the dog to be aware of where, where we are going and not where he wants to go. So I use my body to block him if he wants to get ahead. I also am using the leash if he stays behind or gets away, I'm going to give him a correction. But I don't want to give Parker a million corrections. I just want him, I want to teach him where he, he should be, the position where he should be. So his neck and shoulder should be by our left leg. So I'm going to praise that. Okay. Yes. That's very good. If he gets ahead, that, that's when I give him a correction. Uh -uh. That's it. Yes. Yes, that's very good. And this is a very good walk from Parker. I like that I'm not fighting with him. There's no tension on the leash. This is a very good walk. Good boy. This is nice. Ah, ah. So if he gets ahead, I use my voice, make, give him a correction so he knows that he shouldn't be getting ahead. That's nice. And this is a, this is a good walk from him. I know. So you can see, if he tried to get ahead, I use just my body to block him. This is very good. Come on, let's go. So outdoors, there are a couple dogs playing. He got his attention, but when that happens, I just continue moving. I don't, I don't let him go towards there to explore or anything like that. This is a very good walk. Nice job, buddy. Parker. And that's a very good walk from Parker. He did very good. Nice job, buddy. Come on, let's go. We're going to continue improving, make it a little bit better and better every day. Nice job. 